Three, two, one. Oh, hey guys. Welcome to my GTV. I've been wanting to make a video for my Instagram for a while now, and now that I have a GoPro, I'm gonna start making more video content. And originally my first video idea was going to be five destinations for 2020, but that that's still a good idea, but I think today I actually want to talk about five things they don't tell you about vlogging because this is my first video and it's really awkward and they just don't, they don't warn you about that. So we're going to cover five things that they don't tell you about vlogging. Item number one is picking a neutral background that has good lighting and nothing embarrassing. So it's kind of hard to see, but I've had to remove everything from my background. Usually we have towels hanging up on the door and usually we leave the closet open. We had stuff on the floor that I had to hide and anything that was a bright color, I had to either hide behind the bed so you can't see it's tucked in on the floor or tuck it behind the computer because it would draw away um, attention from me or from the video. So that's actually really hard. Number two, as I'm sure you can imagine, is just talking to myself over and over and over and repeating similar sentences can get really awkward and you'll mix up whether or not you said something before or the way you articulate it, you, you change it as you go and um, you find that you use your hands for everything just because you don't know what to do with them. So um, number two is that it's awkward to make videos, but that's okay because the product will be worth the struggle. <laughs> Number three is background noise. So as I'm sure you guys can hear, I've got some quiet music playing in the background now. There are sites where you can get like copyright free music. And I found a channel on YouTube that provides it. So I might be using that for some of my videos depending on how that works for me. Um, another thing to consider is just regular noise from like the outside, like I'm in my room right now, but we have a train that goes by that can be kind of loud or we have a dog. So you have to be cognizant of those when you're filming your videos so that you don't have to be constantly re-filming re different scenes because of background noise, so. Number four is editing is gonna be hard. So I'm filming this right now and then I'll be editing it afterwards, but already I can just imagine how difficult this is gonna be because you have an idea in your mind of what you want the video to be like. And I think you have to be really realistic with the level of skill that you have. So my skill is Nada, <laughs> it's a brand new beginner. So I'm really excited about this next step and to introduce film into, and video more so than film, into my gallery and into my overall portfolio. So editing will be a skill that I will have to start taking classes on and maybe having some more mentorship because I want my videos to be the quality that I wanna provide. And in the end, if I end up having to hire that out, that's something else that I'll have to do. But for now, I think editing is going to be a really hard part of vlogging. Last but not least, number five is practice makes perfect. So as I've made this video, I've seen how as I go through my different talking points, it becomes more fluid, it becomes more natural. And it's still really awkward, but it feels less awkward. And I think as it goes on, um, you can see, especially with the really professional vloggers, that they know what they're doing. They that they're in their they're in their zone and so i'm really excited to see how this develops for me and so for all you vloggers out there i really look up to you this is not easy work and i'm excited to uh, join your ranks as a videographer so there you have it guys those are the five things that i've discovered about vlogging this is obviously just my first video that i've made but i'm excited to explore more with this if you have any tips as far as vlogging or using a gopro or any sort of um being in front of a camera, please let me know either in the comments or uh, in my DMs. So, um, hope you guys enjoyed this and see you soon.